baby, don't check for me. Taking time out. Hey guys, it's Sharika. Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. I feel like I always come on camera looking like this, starting to vlog off like this every day, but she works out. I'm getting ready to fix myself some lemon water and then I'm going to the gym. <clears throat> Get like a little living room refresh. It was about time. I just switched up a few different things so we're gonna do a living room tour a little later on if you guys saw the short and you follow me on instagram then you've seen it already i just changed some of the decor on the stand like i always do and then some small changes on the living room table and then on the credenza so Nothing major. And then I put something back there, but I'm not too sure I'm going to keep it like that. We'll go through that a little bit later. I'm thinking about going to at home, but it just depends on how I feel after the gym. Because I've been wanting to go over there because I haven't been over there in a while. Um, I don't know how long it's been. Because y'all know usually they have like the same stuff. So I haven't really been in there, but I think I want to go in there and see if they put out anything new. And then I might go to Home Goods, and I'm gonna take y'all with me, of course. Y'all, I just like to do warm lemon water in the morning because it just gets my digestive system going. So, I like it. So, I'm getting ready to write in my devotional journal really quick. And I need to go in my garage and look for my Tom Ford book. Because y'all y'all know I have like every table book. Like I have all the table books. But I just decided to pack some of them in a box and put them in my garage. Because, you know, you can't use them all. So y'all know I like to switch them out. But I want to bring my um, Tom Ford book back out and put it on the table. Because what I did was I just did my decor pieces that I have on my shelf. I just basically pulled all my darker pieces out. So it looks very masculine in here, which I like because to me that looks very expensive. So um, that's what I did, but I like the way it looks. It looks really cute. So I got this one little space up here that I'm saving for the Tom Ford book. I really don't feel like dealing with that garage because I don't like going down there because I don't know if something done slid up in there. Okay, y'all, so I am filming on my phone, first of all. I'm leaving the gym and I am headed to Home Goods. I'm going to my favorite Home Goods, which is the one off Southside Boulevard. It used to be the one on the beach, but they've been slacking lately. And the last time I went to the one off Southside Boulevard, they had so much stuff. So I'm gonna head in there, see what they have. I wanted to go to at home, but y'all know they always have like the same thing. So I don't think I'm gonna go in there. Cause that's like a good little ways away from me. So I'm gonna just go to Home Goods. It's 9.50 right now. The mall doesn't open until 11 o'clock and I need to take this stuff back. So I'm gonna have to do something while I'm over here. Um, until the mall opens. What is that something? I have no idea, but I'm sure I'll find something to do. <laughs>
they didn't have anything in home goods. They had a lot of pumpkins. I guess they're getting ready for Halloween and Thanksgiving. So now I'm going to go in Michael's and then Target. Can y'all see me? Okay. Michael's and Target. I like this right here, but it just, it looks so plastic. Y'all remember I got these from Hobby Lobby, but they, the stem wasn't long enough. It just looks so plastic, but it's so cute. Well, I think I'm gonna get these. They're cute. How many of y'all remember when the floating candles was a thing? I never had it in my place before but I can remember like going to people's house and they had it and it, I always thought it was so pretty <laughs> so cute <laughs> they look kind of cool yeah, I've always wanted one of yes, these yeah. little things like a cricket where you can make the shirts and stuff a little mug this is so cool if you want to make your mug so cute oh look at that this is cool I can sell the little easels here y'all know I got mine from Target for five dollars but 40% off. These are cuter. And they have the bigger ones for $24. Oh, well, I did buy some stems for the space that I have that I bought a while ago that I haven't used yet. I just spray painted it. I'm gonna try to style it with these stems and they were on sale. Instead of $6.99 each, they were $2.99 each. So I'm happy about that. I'm happy about my little stems. Let me see the name of them so I can tell y'all right now because y'all know I forget. I forget the name of them. This is called a, it's a fern. And they're cute. They're not too shiny. Y'all see how it looks? They're not shiny at all. So I really like this. I think they'll look really cute in my base and then I'll sit them on my island. And I think that'll look pretty. Either my island or my table. But I'm thinking more my island on the edge. I think that'll look really, really good. So, all right, let's go to the mall. exactly the same but it's black I'm gonna get it so cute okay I we're gonna do a little try on haul real quick so I got this dress right here I got another white button down I got these little shorts but I don't have to try those on but I'm gonna try this stuff on for y'all really quick Back. I like this. This 
is cute. And this one was in store. They didn't have the orange one. already that's pink and white I think it's so cute it's so light and glowy I really like this one too this will look really cute try to look past the hat and the <laughs> yeah this will be cute all right y'all I'm back home I just fixed myself a salad this looks so bomb so I'm getting ready to enjoy my lunch, edit the vlog that you guys are watching. Y'all don't forget to follow my food channel, Eating Pretty. I'll have the link to it in the description box below. Okay, y'all, so I'm not gonna tell y'all how I did this part twice. This is my second time. I already sat down, started editing the video, trying to download it to my computer, and the footage was wiped out. I don't know what keep happening or what's causing my footage to delete i had that same issue with my video that i did last week on my cooking channel it's so annoying so here we are again this is the dress um that i showed that i got from amazon so i just purchased it in the new color it's so cute and i also have an orange one but that one has not came yet so um but i love it it has the shoulder pads it's really cute grab my curls and fell i was looking real cute just want to show y'all what I got from H&M. So pretty much everything that you guys um, saw me try on. I bought a white button down. I know it's coming up pretty bright on camera. Um, an oversized button down. I know y'all like, girl, you don't need no more button downs. But I feel like you can never have enough. Um, and I don't have one that's really oversized. This one is in an extra large. And I like the way it looks. So I just felt like... I needed it. I need like an oversized white button down. So yeah, grab this one. It's really cute. And then I bought these little black, I guess you can call them biker shorts. They have like the ribbed detail. This is my second time purchasing these. But I don't know where my old ones are. I had these for like, my other ones I had for a very long time, like some years. I don't know where they are. So I just picked up another pair because I wanted to wear my other ones last week and I couldn't find them. So I said that once I go back to H&M, I'll grab another pair. So I grabbed these. And then next up, I bought these two little dresses. I showed y'all this in the dressing room, but I didn't try it on. I had the large and the large was just showing way too much body. So I try not to show too much body and it was just giving too much body. So I went up a size and got the extra large because I wanted it to fit, you know, like a relaxed fit, something I could dress up or down. That's always my thing. When I make purchases, I want to be able to wear it more than one way. So, you know, I could throw on some heels and still look sexy. I could throw on some flats. I can even wear like some trainers with this and it still look cute. So I bought the taupe and the black and these were $19.99. Very comfortable. I'll try on the black one for you. So this is what the extra large looks like. So it's really cute. The large was just hugging like I was going to the club or something like that. But this one is just like a more relaxed fit and I really, really like it. So and then... You guys saw this dress. It's just a cute little black baby doll dress. I'm a sucker for baby doll dresses and this one was super cute. I have this one in a pink and white. So I already knew that it was gonna fit but I just wanted to try it on for you guys. This one was $19.99. Um, I forgot to show, tell y'all the price. The button down was $24.99. And what else? The shorts, what are they? And then the shorts were 
$9.99. And then the last thing that I picked up was the black satin wrap dress. So this is the orange one. It's so cute and this is the exact one. The part, the dress that I was taking back was a different wrap dress that I thought would fit like this. It was just a different color but it didn't fit the same girl. That one was a true medium and girl, I ain't know about a medium, okay? So this one I got in the medium because it does run oversized. Well, depending on your vibe, I mean, I think the large one would probably look cute on me too but I like the way that the medium one fit very nice and sexy for like a nice little dinner date so i thought this was really cute this dress was 29.99 so yeah that is everything that i got from h&m i've been putting the stuff back in the bag i need to hang this stuff up so now i'm going to take you guys up front and i'm going to show you how the stems look in the vase that i told y'all about earlier um it turned out really cute but i have to go get some more because i want a fuller look so let's go up front okay so here's the stems and like i said this is my second time doing this so i'm a little aggravated and i already kind of set it up so we'll go through it again but just know this is my second time doing it i ain't got time for this okay <laughs> but these are the stems and they look really really good but i wanted a, a fuller look i do have styrofoam in the bottom of my vases i always do that when i want it to stand a certain way so i have um like i said the styrofoam in the bottom and i have this one in the middle because that's the look that i'm going for like i want them to come out of the middle and on the side so i want it to be like really really full um, I got nine stems from the store and I told y'all they are on sale right now for $2.99. The original price is $6.99. So I want to go back before the sale ends to get some more. So I'm not too sure how many more I'm going to get because like I said, I want a really nice full look. Um, and then let me back y'all up some. And then what can y'all see? Nothing. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Here's the... Okay. And then this is the vase that I was telling you guys about, but because it's been in the storage room with other vases, it's kind of scuffed up now. So I need to repaint it, spray paint it over, but we're worried about that later. But I wanted to kind of have it just sitting here, just ignore the mess because like I said, I was working over here trying to edit this video for y'all and realized that my footage is deleted. So here we are. But this is like where i wanted to kind of sit it here or either on the table so either on the counter or on the table i really haven't decided yet and then these are the two bases that i told you guys that i wanted to i'm going to switch them up i just you know how i like to play around with things first before making the final decision so these are not permanent i just have them sitting there they're just like a placeholder Okay, excuse the TV because I was also watching a little bit of YouTube while I was editing. So, girl. But that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. I am Trika B. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.